Usam ibn Laden, you know, rajul damawi. He's a bloodthirsty individual. Oh. I didn't have a clue who he was at that time. Mm-hmm. So this was prior to 9-11. There was a, a university, I think it was in New York, if I'm not mistaken. I think they sacked a lecturer because the Muslim students had mentioned, she warned them pre- prior to the class that, you know, we're going to show pictures of the Prophet or, you know, supposed pictures of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa And I think some of the students, they complained mm-hmm. and they said it's disrespectful to us. She went ahead and done it, and I think they fired her. Some ulama, you know, said that you never understand yourself until you understand you create and worship Allah. Going back to Philadelphia for da'wah, when I was there, I got married, and that's how I got connected to Philadelphia. So that's where my connection with Philadelphia started. I never knew Sheikh Albani when I was back home. No. Wa anyu Qardawi. No. Wa anyu Qardawi, this deviated Sheikh, because he was on the TV. I didn't know Sheikh Albani, Sheikh Ben Baz. But anyu Qardawi, so awam al nas dinu qardawi more than Sheikh Albani Sheikh Mbaz. You know, Malcolm X, for example, Rahimallah Ta'ala, he left the nation. So there was a large group of people in Philadelphia that left the nation and they you know, embraced Sunni Islam. Sheikh has a certain request. Sorry, so to me. So, Sheikh, wait, wait, wait. wait. I'll just call him a column. Yeah, I was And I was like, I'm comfortable with it. You know, from a religious point of view, yeah. after researching the matter, after yeah. reading it. Uh, so you can finish. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>